Is your iPhone stuck on the verifying update and never progresses? This post will you how to fix it. Solution 1. Lock the iPhone and wake it up. If iPhone is stuck on the verifying update screen, try this simple fix. Lock then wake it up. Pressing the sleep or wake button can help you resume the update process when it wakes up. To lock the iPhone, press the sleep or wake button. To unlock it again and continue with the update, press either the home or sleep or wake button. Solution 2. Check your network condition. To increase the chances of your phone receiving a response from an online server, ensure your iPhone is connected to faster Wi-Fi. Try using other network apps on your iPhone to test and check network conditions. If it's slow, you should connect your iPhone to a better Wi-Fi connection. If you still experience laggy connections after switching Wi-Fi networks, try connecting to your mobile data network instead. This may be helpful. Solution 3. Verify with your cellular data. The router-based firewall may be blocking access to the verification servers. Switch over to a cellular connection to complete the process. All you have to do is swipe up from the bottom edge of your screen and tap on the Wi-Fi icon to shut it off. Now click on cellular data. Afterward, head to the software update screen and select install now. Solution 4. Activate and deactivate airplane mode. Step 1. Open the settings application and tap on airplane mode. Switch on the airplane mode. This will ensure that all wireless connections are disabled. Step 2. Afterward, reboot the iPhone while the mode is turned on. Go to settings and select the airplane mode option. Step 3. Now switch off the airplane mode to activate the device's settings. After you have completed these steps, reconnect the iPhone to the Wi-Fi network. Once the connection is successful, download the software update and see if you get the verifying update screen message. Solution 5. Reset your iPhone. If you have difficulty verifying an update on iPhone and it's frozen, resetting the device may be a viable solution. By resetting your iPhone, all applications and programs will be disabled after which the device will restart. Different iPhone models have different resetting. Solution 6. Redownload iOS Update. If your iPhone gets stuck on the verifying update screen, try deleting and downloading the iOS update again and see if it works. Step 1. Go to Settings and choose General then iPhone Storage. In the list of apps that will appear, look for the iOS update you want to remove and tap on it. You will see a Delete Update option. Click on it. Step 2. Now that you have deleted the outdated iOS version, update your device again. To do that, head to Settings, General, then Software Update, and select Latest iOS Version. Solution 7. Reset all network settings on iPhone. Step 1. To reset network settings, open your settings and choose General. Scroll to Reset. Step 2. Now, select the Reset All Network Settings option to reset your device's network settings. Step 3. When prompted, Enter your passcode and confirm that you want to reset your iPhone's network settings. Step 4. After the automatic reboot of your device is complete, set up the device and reconnect to Wi-Fi. Solution 8. Update your iPhone via iTunes. Step 1. Install the latest version of iTunes on your computer, then connect the iPhone to your PC with a USB cord. Now open iTunes, select your device, navigate to Summary, and choose Check for Updates. Step 2. Tap the Download and Update option and your iPhone will instantly begin updating. Solution 9. Boot iPhone into DFU mode. Step 1. Start by connecting iPhone to PC with a USB cable. Next, open iTunes and then press the home button along with the sleep or wake button for about 10 seconds. Step 2. Once the screen turns completely black, press and hold down the sleep or wake button. Solution 10. Restore your iPhone to factory settings. Step 1. Navigate to settings, select general and then click on the option for reset. Finally, hit the button that says erase all content and settings. Step two, enter the Apple ID password to proceed. Solution 11, disable any VPN or proxy connections. If your device has a VPN installed, it might cause verifying update stuck problems. So, turn off the VPN or proxy connections. This can help you easily connect with iOS and verify your updates promptly. To disable a VPN, head to your iPhone settings, Choose VPN and switch it off. Solution 12. Check available storage on iPhone. There should be enough storage space to update an iPhone, at least 5 gigabytes. Step 1. Head to Settings to General and click on iPhone Storage to see the available storage space. Step 2. Choose the files you want to delete and hit the Delete button to free up space. Solution 13. Check the iPhone's date and time. If you still can't verify iOS updates, 
check that your date and time settings are correct. The date and time must match that of your local region. Otherwise, it can interfere with the normal functioning of your iPhone. To automatically set your date and time, head to the settings section and select general. Look for date and time and switch on the set automatically button. Restart the iPhone and try verifying your iPhone update. Solution 14. Check Apple server status. If you are struggling with Apple breakdown, a simple search Apple server status will give you the necessary information from their official website regarding whether or not they are available. This is the most straightforward method if you want to quickly and easily ascertain whether the issue lies with Apple's servers. If the issue is with Apple's servers, you'll have to wait patiently for the issue to be resolved. Solution 15. Quickly fix iPhone stuck on verifying update. Step 1. Install and launch the software on the computer. On the primary interface, choose the option for iOS system recovery. Step 2. Connect iPhone to the computer with a USB cord and click on Trust This Computer when prompted. This will help iOS system recovery recognize your device successfully. Step 3. Boot the iPhone into DFU or recovery mode using the instructions on the interface. Step 4. Check your phone's model and other details, then hit Repair to download the plugin to fix the issue. Once downloading is complete, it will immediately repair the problem of verifying updated iPhone software. Thank you.